This is Audio Lens from Isotope, and it's completely free for a limited time. Now, you will own it forever, but you just have to pick it up by November 22nd. Now, this actually isn't a plugin, meaning you do not run it in your DAW. Instead, you launch it like any other standalone program. So what exactly does Audio Lens do? Well, it analyzes any audio played on your system, things like the EQ, you know, the overall tone, dynamics, and the stereo width. And it allows you to quickly create a reference from any source, whether that's Spotify, YouTube, your own media player, you know, whatever, and then apply that sound of the professionally produced track to your own mixes or even individual instruments. Now you could do this manually by using an analyzer in your DAW and an EQ, and then, you know, try to match that curve. But where this really shines is when you use it in combination with Ozone 10 or Neutron 4. Let me show you how this works. I'll play a song, and of course, I'll have to mute it on the video for copyright reasons. I'll hit capture and then let Audio Lens analyze the song for at least eight seconds, but it can be 20 seconds, 30 seconds, a minute, you know, whatever. And no audio is being recorded, all right? It's only analyzing the mix or analyzing the audio, so it's completely legal. Again, we are not recording audio with Audio Lens, it's only analyzing the audio, all right? Once you're done, hit stop give the reference a name. We'll head into the DAW. I already have Ozone on my master. I'll come to the assistant. Take me far away from where we both started. I need to go back where we last departed somewhere. We can put our past behind us anywhere. We can go Click the target files, and immediately we have access to the reference we just captured. Select it, and it will build a mastering chain. And play your mix. I also have other references that I captured earlier. So let's check those out. So as you can see, this is a really great way to build your reference library and apply those professionally produced sounds to your mix. But you can also do this to individual instruments. So let's say you really love the guitar sound of Lamb of God or Meshuggah or whoever. All you need to do is play a part of the song where only the guitar is playing, or in this case, I happen to have guitar stems from Lamb of God. Just like last time, play the audio, capture it, give the reference a name, head into your DAW. I already have Neutron 4 on this track. Go to the Assistant, Custom Files, and select that reference. Or maybe I want more of a Meshuggah guitar sound.
And you can do this for any instrument, whether it's guitar, bass, piano, drums, individual drums. Like if there's a certain kick sound that you like, just capture it and apply it to your track. You can even do this for vocals or even your favorite podcaster. So just capture their sound, apply it to your track, and boom, professional sounding podcast in about 30 seconds. No need to concern yourself with the skills of mixing if you have audio lens and Neutron 4 or Ozone 10. You can always get perfect results just by sampling the overall tone, the overall sound of uh, you know sounds that are already professionally produced and uh, that are already out there. So to pick this up for yourself, head to this site. Of course, the link will be in the description below. And if you don't have Neutron or Ozone, the best way to get them is with the Music Production Suite. Of course, you can buy them individually, but it's much cheaper to just get everything in one bundle. Plus, the other plugins included, like RX and Insight, are also must-haves. So I'll have some links in the description below for that as well. All right, so that is Audio Lens from Isotope.